Bottom and local rivers will now be protected for years to come. The Wood Pawkatuck River watershed has now nationally been recognized as the Wild and Scenic River. Meteorologist TJ Del Santo is in Exeter tonight with what this new designation means for federal funding and keeping the water system safe for future generations. There are more than 200 rivers across the country that are part of the National Wild Scenic River System, and now Rhode Island has seven. People who visit the Wood Pocketuck watershed get an escape from the noise of traffic and construction. All they're going to hear is bird song and the wind whispering through the trees. These pristine waters will now be protected for years to come as this 300 square mile area is now nationally recognized as wild and scenic. Rhode Island's congressional delegation worked to get the classification passed through Congress and signed into law to bring federal money into the state. Uh, this is an estuary. It feeds into our, our water system. It's part of our uh, e ecosystem here in, uh, in our state that we need to preserve for future generations. Sky Drone 12 over the Wood River. A river's classification as wild means there is little development in the surrounding areas, and scenic means the river is still largely undeveloped but accessible by roads. It ensures that we're going to uh, protect this area from, uh, from uh, economic development that would, uh, could potentially alter this area, damage the watershed. It's a tribute to the, all of the citizens who worked so hard to make this happen. We helped, but it was their, their work and their effort that made it happen. The money could be used for some restoration along the rivers, but the Wood Pocketuck Stewardship Council would like to start small to create a big impact. Get the people out from the urban centers to come and learn to kayak on these rivers and to see them and to understand that these belong to them as well as the people who live here. It's expected that about $150,000 in federal funds will come into the state annually to help protect these rivers. I'm TJ Del Santo, Eyewitness News.